Hey, the video you're about to watch comes from a mastermind slash question and answer a session that I hosted not long ago for affiliates who are fairly new to the game and promoting specific high ticket digital products. So there's going to be a ton of value shared across the entire masterminds. And if you want to join us in becoming a high ticket, high profit affiliate marketer, make sure you go over to my 15 day challenge.com after you watch this video to learn how to set up your high ticket affiliate marketing business in 15 days or less. Enjoy the video. Uh, Kenton, I see you up there with your hand up. Go ahead, Kenton. What's up, mate? Um, I, uh, you know, I've gotten started with, you know, legendary, especially I have other products, whatever, but just with legendary in specific, you know, I got started maybe two months ago, November 18th. And I okay. set up a pixel, I guess, three weeks ago. Um, and I'm, I'm doing really well with just TikTok. I'm good at, at TikTok, you know, content stuff. I've gained a lot of followers. And just like on a daily basis, I'm doing over $200 a day, just in like, you know, whatever. And like 15 awesome. to 20 signups, right? Uh -huh. But I want to, I'm trying to scale because I don't know. I just see like the long term and I'm watching you and stuff like that. So I set up a pixel. I learned from your YouTube. And, you know, from the three weeks, I can see the total events are 79 point nine thousand but i don't know what to do after that do i set up like a retargeting ad and then just send it back to them or yeah so your pixel is probably set up are you using click funnels that's my first question yes okay and so your pixel is actually set up through click funnels uh well i just have legendary pixel set up on the facebook thing and then set up through click funnels i think yeah so do you okay do you have it set up in legendary marketers dashboard too or not no. Okay. So let me go ahead and um, I'm going to go ahead and share my screen really quickly. And um, th th this is kind of an in-depth thing. There's a lot to talk about here, um, but I'll kind of try to answer your question and, and, then, and then go through it uh, as quickly as possible. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen here. And uh, Kenton, can you see my screen that says Zoom right across the front? Yes, sir. Cool. All right. So the first thing um, that I would do uh, if I was in your situation is I would log into legendary marketer, go into uh, the funnels here and whatever funnel you're using, you're probably using one of the business challenge funnels, either, either this one or black. doesn't matter what you, which one you use. They're, they're the same, but just make sure you use the same one consistently. And then what you want to do is go over to your affiliate links and there's training. Um, I'll find the training for this in, in the back office in just a second. But what you want to do is you want to get your tracking pixel uh, on your actual legendary marketer um, uh, affiliate links as well and really the reason that's important is because down here on the checkout page you're going to add two different ones and once again there's training that shows you how to do this um, mm -hmm. but this is how you're going to be able to track buyers right because long term you're going to want to know you're going to want to have that buyer information like you don't want just people who are hitting your website you want to have that buyer information that's going to be valuable long term so that's the first thing that you're going to want to do and that training is somewhere if you click on affiliates that training is somewhere in here, tracking tags and pickle, pixels 4.9. This lesson right here inside Legendary Marketer um, will we'll show you exactly how to do that. So that's the first thing that you wanna do. Um, the next thing you wanna do is, so what, what I do is I will basically then create a custom audience, okay? Cause you, you only have one website with the pixel on it right now. Right. Okay, so yeah, so what I would do is I would go into yeah, and, and, and this is recorded, so you can always refer back to this this section here, um, but but it's good to take notes too. So what I would do is I would create an audience that has hit your website, basically anyone who's been pixeled in let's say the last thirty days, okay. And at this point, we don't need to differentiate between people who buy and people who didn't, and people who opted in, and people who did. We don't need to do that. So an audience of people who visited your website been pixeled in the last 30 days or 15 days, doesn't really matter. I'd probably just start with 30. So that's gonna be your custom audience. Then what you wanna do is you wanna start by running uh, retargeting ads. So you create an ad and you serve that to your custom audience, okay? Now what, what's gonna happen here is some of the people are gonna hit your website and bounce away. Some of the people are going to hit your website, opt in and not buy. And some of the people who are going to be pixeled are going to hit your website, opt in, and then buy the business builder challenge. But regardless, we want to serve even the people who buy ads because it's easy to buy a $7 business builder challenge. 
it's a lot harder to actually start going through the challenge. But you are going to make more money when people actually go through the challenge and they start buying the back end products. So we want to stay in front of those people as well. So just to keep it simple, on anyone who's hit our website in 30 days, we want to run ads. And basically, there's two main retargeting ads that I would start with. You can pull testimonials from Legendary Marketer, and they have resources. If You can probably find them on that same page that I showed you, or you can reach out to support. They have like a uh, database of videos that you can use. So the, what I would do is I would first create a testimonial ad to research people, and I would just do maybe like a 30-second introduction with you, just like selfie style, real casual, like, Hey, I know you checked out whatever your website's called. Uh, maybe you're thinking about starting affiliate marketing and learning with Legendary Marketer. I just wanted to share some stories with other folks who went through the 15-Day Business Builder Challenge. And then you can splice that in with the testimonials that Legendary Marketer gives you, and that's one ad. The second ad I would run is, is overcoming objections because that's what we always want to do. We want to show social proof and overcome objections. So I happen, one way you find objections is by emailing, by contacting people who are on your email list. But I already happen to know that uh, through doing this, that one of the main objection with Legendary Marketer is, is people are willing to invest, but they're afraid nobody, nobody's going to help them, right? So they're like, they've probably bought courses in the past from some one-off guy who, who creates the course and that doesn't support it. So that's their number one fear. So my secondary ad might be like, Hey, are you concerned that nobody is going to help you? Well, guess what? Legendary Marketer has a community over 26,000 people. They have 45 employees working around the clock or whatever to help you learn and that type of thing. And I would run those two ads. I would start with like five bucks a day. And basically where we're going to send them to is like back to um, a pre-sale page. I would create a third page on your bridge, on your funnel that basically, uh, is kind of like a pre-sale reintroducing them to legendary marketer but also has the link to the legendary marketer sales page does that make sense like the offer stack or no yes the offer stack exactly so if you you have my offer stack page is that what correct yeah yeah so yeah i would run all my ads to the offer stack page and the idea there is if they haven't bought that's a great way to get them into the 15-day challenge and if they have already bought, who, who cares? They saw our face. It reminded them, oh yeah, when I get home from work, I got to log into Legendary Marketer and do day three of the 15 day challenge. So I hope that cleared things up and was extremely valuable to you. If it was, feel free to drop a like. I would really appreciate it. If you have any follow up questions, leave them in the comments. And if you want to see some of the other questions that were addressed in this mastermind, make sure you go over to the channel. You'll find them posted there. And if you want to join us, start the 15 day business builder challenge by going to my 15 day challenge.com, which you can find the link in the description as well. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.